Hi, it's Joe. Uh, Minnick, better known as uh, Jersey Joe, from Rust Never Sleeps, Joe 2, my YouTube channel. And I have my two other movies that I want to talk about. Uh, and this movie is called Mirror's Crossing. It's like a film noir movie about uh, the gangsters in Chicago during the uh, Prohibition time uh, in the 1920s. And it stars uh, Gabriel Byrne and uh, John Totaro and Albert Finney. And it's a really good movie. It's a Cullen Brothers movie. Uh, the story is really good. Well acted. Dialogue is outstanding. And it's just it's just a great movie. I mean, uh, it has everything that you want in a, a like a gangster type uh, movie and the, the period piece of the 20s and all the the, the great dialogue that are, that's always in the Coen Brothers movie. It's uh, it's a little bit violent, so if you're not into you know violent movies, this is not for you. But if you're into gangster movies and film noir movies that were done during the uh, early 40s and 50s. This movie's for you in Morris Crossing. It's very good. It's about the uh, Irish mob and the Italian mob in the uh, 1920s, uh, early 30s in Chicago. How they tried to take control of the town of Chicago and how the police were on the take. And it's just a very well made movie. A lot of good dialogue and a good storyline. So I really highly recommend Morris Crossing. And it's out on DVD. And my last movie that I want to talk about is a classic movie that made, was made in the 70s with Robert Redford and Faye Dunaway. It's called Three Days of the Condor. Also, Max von Sydow stars in it. It's, about, it's like uh, a movie about the corruption in the government and how they manipulate countries and overthrow uh, governments. And Robert Redford works for like a, a cover operation that decodes uh, messages from CIA. And something goes awry, and they like the CIA people come in and kill all the people in his office. And he's uh, the only one that's uh, alive because actually he goes out and gets lunch for everybody. But it's a really good movie that uh, has very good dialogue, good story, and it tells about the corruption that goes behind. Uh, what goes on in the CIA and the FBI, and it's very. Uh, eye-opening story and Robert Redford is outstanding in it, so is Faye Dunaway and Cliff Robertson's in it, so uh, I highly recommend that you get this. I don't know if it's on, uh, it should be on uh, DVD, but I have a VHS uh, version of it and it's just an outstanding movie and I think you would enjoy it. It's a uh, thriller movie, suspense, and it's well worth your uh, time and try and seek it out on uh, DVD if you, don't, if you don't have a VHS copy, which we probably don't because there's n nobody makes VHS anymore. So try to go to Amazon.com or go to your local uh, Barnes & Noble, which is the only store left now to uh, sell DVDs because all the movie stores are out of business. Unfortunately, you got red boxes. And uh, you don't want me to get me started on that. I can't stand red boxes. It's so impersonal. You don't go to. A, they don't have any blockbusters anymore, and they don't have any uh, stores like that where you can go and get a video. Maybe you can try and get it at your free library, also, because my brother works at a free library here in New Jersey, and they have a lot of good DVDs. So, if you want to look for a good mystery and a suspenseful movie, Three Days of the Condor. Check it out. It's well worth your while. Peace out, and I'll see you next Sunday.